With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, in the figure shown, find the moment of inertia of the square plate having mass m side a about an x is passing through the point c and in the plane of the plate. So if you see here, we know that the moment of inertia of uh, this square plate about an x is passing through point C and perpendicular to this plane is ma square by 6. We can get that if you see here the moment of inertia of this square plate about uh, this axis passing through the center and uh, as well as about this axis passing through the center and in the plane it is we know that it is same as that of the rod moment of inertia so i will write down i1 and uh, it will be equals to m a square by 12 if you see this this is the axis 1 and this is the axis 3 so i will write down i1 and i3 it is equals to m a square by 12 and uh, if you see here if I write down the perpendicular axis theorem, axis theorem, I will write down the moment of inertia about an axis passing through x axis about y axis is equals to about an axis which is perpendicular to the plane and uh, z axis right so it means that if i take this as x axis and this as y axis then the moment of inertia about an axis uh, z axis that is passing through the center and uh, perpendicular to the plane it will be related like this so i will write down ma square by 12 plus ma square by 12 it will be iz that is m a square by 6 and uh, if I write down if you see this is i2 and i4 so we know that the moment of inertia about an axis passing through axis uh, this axis 2 and moment of inertia about axis 4 will be same because if you see the both are diagonal axis both are diagonal axis axis so if you see if i take this as x dash axis this as y dash axis so same perpendicular axis theorem we can apply here and we will write down x dash plus y dash is equals to z axis so the x dash and y dash is nothing but i2 and i4 so the two are equal so i2 plus i4 is equals to ma square by if you see here it is 6 and if i take them equals to i naught so i will write down 2 i naught is equals to this so from here i will write down this i naught is equals to ma square by 12 so basically the i1 will be equals to i2 is equals to i3 is equals to i4 is equals to ma square by 12. The moment of inertia about x is 1, 2, 3, 4, all of them it will be ma square by 12. Simple, thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.